So the ice out here is really super neat. Like, one thing that I never knew before was that ice is forming around little twigs stuck in the water. It creates kind of like a volcano pattern. See all the, let's see, tendency for the water to stick to itself to uh, climb things. It creates this bubble above the ice. It's a nicer one back there. It's pretty cool. I never knew that. And uh, the ice is of amazing quality right now. It's like that thickness where you can stand on it in some points, but in other points you're definitely going to fall through, so it's like super inviting and super terrorizing at the same time. And didn't know this either. You can see all the stomp prints. But if you stomp on the ice, it'll create sound waves underwater. So, watch this. Listen, rather. The sound reverberates all the way over to the other shore. I think it's scaring those birds. And it's really cool. It's, first I thought it was the birds being annoyed that I was stomping on the ice. And then I was realized it was like the ice itself bouncing the sound back to the bottom of the pond. Oh, created a hole. So, yeah, ice is awesome, inviting but dangerous. I can sort of sit on it over there and not fall through, but it's wet and water comes through the cracks. And, uh, yeah, this is Chesterfield, Missouri. This is the Chesterfield Mall where Jim Weibel is teaching kids about whatever it is he teaches them at the Martial Arts Dojo. And it's a lot warmer today, so everything's melting. This will probably be one of the last days where there's ice and snow here, unless we get another cold front. All right. See you later.